today I'm going to talk you through how to make these DIY paperclip earrings. So let's get started. Things you're going to need for this project. Some pliers, scissors to cut your embroidery thread, uh, embroidery thread in any colour of your choice, some earring hooks, if you don't have these they can easily be ordered online or you can make some yourself out of thin wire just please make sure that you file down the edges so they're not sharp when going into your ears two paper clips, some yoohoo glue and a hot glue gun so to start off with we want to heat up our hot glue gun make sure that it's nice and hot and then we want to take our paper clip and we just want to start easing this paper clip apart and start to form a triangle shape with this paper clip. As you can see, I'm starting to form this nice triangle shape with my paper clip, just easing it. Now when you're doing this, you don't want to fully ram it apart so that then these nice straight lines are bent out of shape you want to keep that nice straight shape you just want to try and make sure that these loose ends are starting to meet together so that then we can go in with our hot glue gun hopefully now it's nice and hot remember if you're young then you're going to need an adult to help you with this and you just want to take a nice amount onto that end now try to use the end of your hot glue gun to smooth this out because we don't want a massive glob of this hot glue gun on this. Now don't worry because we are going to go over this with a um, the embroidery thread to cover it so don't worry too much but we do want it to be as smooth as possible really and then you can go in with your other paper clip and push that together to make that shape really nice and as the hot glue dries quickly you now have your perfect triangular shape so once we have glued our triangles into place and the glue has dried and hardened we want to go in with our embroidery thread so we just want to take a small amount of yoohoo glue and just apply that to the edge and then we just want to stick that onto the edge like so and then we just want to thread this through now I've cut my embroidery thread into smaller sections just so that then it's easier for passing through the triangle otherwise you're trying to pass your whole embroidery thread through the triangle and it can get really fiddly so obviously cutting it down like this makes it way less fiddly and much easier to deal with. So you just want to carry on and wrap all the way around the triangle. Okay, so then once you've got to the end, you just want to put your little amount of hot glue on the end there and you just want to wrap again over and just cover the glue and just kind of secure your thread down there you go so as you can see we have fully covered the outside of the triangle with the embroidery thread so now we're going to go in and start wrapping the embroidery thread on the inside. So I'm just going to take a small amount of my Yoohoo glue and I'm going to apply this onto the section where I want to add my embroidery thread to start from. Now if you wanted to start from the top 
then that's absolutely fine but I'm going to start mine from halfway down just because that's the look I want to go for but again all of this is completely optional and you've just got to go for whatever style suits you really and then you just start wrapping sorted you can move it around a bit check it's all in the right position you want and then you just want to come to the back take your yoohoo glue again and apply that in place and then just smooth that off take your scissors if you want to to poke that through to the other side And tie that off into place and there you have it there's your first shape for your earring so I'm just gonna head off camera now and do my other shape so as you can see I have finished wrapping the embroidery thread around the centers of my triangle shapes so now it's time to attach our earring hooks so that we can actually wear these shapes as earrings. So to attach our earring hook on we just want to clamp hold of this little ring at the bottom and we just want to twist that metal open. As you can see there this metal has twisted open so that we can apply the triangle shape on. Now as this bar is quite thick I'm not going to put the whole bar inside my little hook. I'm actually just going to hook a few of my embroidery threads. So there we go that's our triangular shape earrings all complete. I think they look fantastic and super stylish. They only took a few simple steps just simply wrapping the embroidery thread around our reshaped um, paper clips and then simply attaching them onto our earring hoops. <laughs>